Hello everyone, welcome to another Sign Orange review. Once again, we have a new course from Wing Fox, Ancient Fantasy Character Design Dark Angel. This is a 19 hour video course for intermediate artists and the primary art store for the course is Photoshop. The instructor, of course, is Extremis, an amazing artist based in Los Angeles, CA, who has worked for companies like Riot Games as a senior illustrator. First of all, it is important to state before the review that the course is currently updating. This means new lessons will be updated in the future and we don't have access to the entire course at the moment. However, since it's updating, you can get it now at a much lower price, so keep that in mind. As usual, we will give our honest opinion of the course and take a close look at all the additional downloadables you will have access to. So let's dig in. Every course in WinFox comes with a series of downloadables. Let's begin the review by checking those out. Currently, the course only comes with brush sets. That means so far we won't have access to the PSD file of the illustration. A bit upsetting, but there's a hope that they may add it in the future. As we mentioned before, the course is being updated every week or so. Let's check the brushes then. The set comes with 8 brushes. Each brush has a unique feel and honestly, it is a nice surprise that the artist has this small brush library. Having too many brushes can often be distracting and overwhelming. This small set has a very good painting brush that can be used in many subjects such as landscape painting or character creation. Here we show a preview of how each brush looks. Now is the time to check the video lessons. Once again, we will remind you that the course is currently updating, meaning the course is not complete at the moment. So our review won't be able to cover the content of each chapter. As usual, we will leave a voice sample here of the instructor. Generally speaking, the purpose of setting shortcut keys is to improve the efficiency, but also accuracy. For example, his movement and structure how to design. Next, we need to push in the other parts. In this episode, I will push in the whole bottom half of the foreground and the background. And now, let's begin. The first video lesson of the course are dedicated to setting up the workspace and sketching. The first one concentrates on setting up shortcut keys, which is very important for actually Mrs. workflow. He shows us the main ones he always set up in Photoshop. Then, he starts sketching his idea. He does three quick composition sketches and finally chose one to continue painting. Then in the next lesson, he refines the sketch and explains his work process. He likes to divide the painting in sections of layers such as the protagonist, the foreground, the background, and so. Something we really like as it shows how order can be very beneficial in the creation of a digital painting. You will see in this chapter all the process of the sketch and occasionally he will talk here and there giving his art tips. Don't expect him to talk all the time as most of the videos is quite a demo. He will then follow up his chapter with a value phase of the illustration and finish it up with a base color demonstration. Now let's continue with chapter 2. This chapter is currently updating so we don't have access to the last video lessons. Keep that in mind. This chapter starts with what XGMIS calls pushing stage. This is basically rendering and XGMIS shows a complete demo on how he starts to further paint the face, the wings, the metal portions of the characters, and so on. This is an extensive demo as we watch him paint each aspect of the character where he occasionally comments on what he is doing. He gives very good tips on how light works, how one should render metal, and so on. There are no chapters dedicated to foundation skills in this course, but XGMIS does give anatomy or light tips and mini demos throughout the video lessons. The last videos available in this chapter for us at the moment go deeper into adjustments and polishing of the details of the face and the armor. So as you know, this course is not complete at the moment. 
So what can we expect in the future chapters? With our experience reviewing Greenfox courses, we are certain that the entire course will be detailed demo on how Extremis brings to life his beautiful angel illustration. The missing chapters will likely go over the details of the background, the wings, and so on. While adding the special effects, we see he adds to the painting at the end. So this course again feels like a very extensive demo, and Extremis is an artist of very high caliber. And so it was indeed exciting for us to see how he works. Alright, now it's the time to give our opinion of the course. We will give the pros and cons as usual. And remember, we are just reviewing a fragment of it, so let's begin. Pose number one, the video and sound quality are good. The voice quality is okay, but aware of his pronunciation. For those who are picky with this, we will leave a sample of his voice here, so you can judge it for yourselves. Generally speaking, the purpose of setting shortcut keys is to improve the efficiency. Pose number two, it only comes with a brush set for now. They may add a PSD once the course is complete. Pose number three, no time limit to watch the course. You can take your time and watch this course, no time limits to access it. Pose number four, if you're looking for a semi-realistic full detail demo with an amazing Riot Games illustrator, then look no further. Think of this course again as a workshop not an art foundation course. The lecturer uses Photoshop, so users who use this software will learn even more from the course. Pose number five. The course is organized and well-structured. The chapters are well-labeled and the order of the content is good. Pose number six. The course is currently has a discount of 45% off since it's still updating. It is an excellent price for a full detailed demo and again, Extreme Mist skills are very impressive. We recommend you, you get it now before it switches back to its full price. Cons number one, it doesn't work on Opera Bowser. It works on Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge while well, we tested it. Cons number two, the course needs subtitles. Once again, beware of his pronunciation. We did miss subtitles also in this course. WinFox should include the subtitles to artists who are not native English speakers. So it is so important. And cons number three, it doesn't have the PSD file of the illustration, it might include it once a course is completed, but for now, you only have the access to the brushes. At last, we have reached the end of this review. So do we recommend this course? Yes. Extremis is an amazing artist. We were excited to review this course, and just with the fragment of what we saw, we can guarantee you that the extensive demo on his painting process is worth it. However, the course is not perfect, and there are a couple of things to keep in mind before buying. So far, it doesn't include the PSD file. This might change, but we cannot guarantee this. Unfortunately, he also doesn't talk through the demo process. He does give a very good tips here and there, but the course will be mostly him painting every single detail of the illustration. Thanks again for joining us in another Sign Orange review. We will leave in the description the promo code and the link to the course. Also remember, we have Patreon. You can support our studio and get exclusive content like comic and illustrations. We also recently started Coffee. You can also give us tip there if you like our content. Thanks again for watching and we will see you guys in the next episode.